So today we're at uh, Toyota's uh, Centre of Excellence in Altona and we've got the Horizon H2 GP event and we're seeing a lot of kids racing cars around trying to get the main prize. Toyota has interest in a multi-pathway approach to the types of engine or powertrain vehicles that we're bringing to market and one of those is hydrogen through the use of fuel cells and the like. The first 30 minutes of the race is always a great one to watch as the kids really get to know the track, get to know their cars, go through that first burst of energy and vibrancy and plus all the crashing and slipping and really learning how to fix and problem solve and work as a team when things go really wrong. As an educator in STEM, I believe that hands-on experimental processes are really important in developing these skills for our students and connecting them with their future STEM careers. It's been fascinating to see how much knowledge the students have learned in quite a small amount of time. Some of them have come in not knowing anything about hydrogen at all. There's a lack or a gap in education around the hydrogen industry and how that technology can be utilised in the renewable energy field as a solution to some of the current problems we have. So hydrogen renewable technology is only growing in Australia and across the world. So it's really fantastic to see programs like H2GP really try to get the next generation interested and involved as well. Because they're going to be the future engineers, future scientists, future people working in STEM. One, two, three! Yeah. Yeah.